British greetings, the perfect start to an English conversation. Hello everyone, and welcome to another exciting lesson. Today, we are going to delve into British culture, specifically focusing on the greetings used in various social contexts. You know, it's always a great idea to kickstart any conversation with a warm greeting. And in Britain, there's quite a variety to choose from. So, without any further ado, let's get started. When you meet a friend or someone you know well, the British usually opt for casual greetings. A simple, hello, or, hi, works perfectly in most cases. However, you might often hear British people say, all right? This might sound a bit odd, as it's not a question about your well-being, but rather a friendly and informal way to say hello. So, when someone asks you, all right? Don't start explaining how your day was. Just respond with a nod or say, all right. On the other hand, formal greetings are used in professional or more official settings. The usual, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening are your go-to options here. Remember, good night is not a greeting in British English, it is a farewell. Be aware of the time of day when using these greetings, as using the incorrect greeting can be seen as a faux pas. There are also some regional greetings you might come across in different parts of the UK. For instance, in Northern England, it's common to hear EY up, which is a friendly way of saying hello. In Scotland, you might hear I or Hiya, while in Wales, Shwa Mai, pronounced Shu Mai, is used in some areas. While these aren't necessary to know unless you're traveling to these specific areas, they can add some fun flavor to your English conversation skills. British people also use greetings based on the time of day. We've already touched on good morning, good afternoon, and good evening in the formal greetings section. But did you know that a simple morning or evening can work just as well in a more casual setting? Try using these the next time you're striking up a casual conversation. And there we have it. I hope you've enjoyed exploring some of the common greetings used in British culture and that you'll be able to use them confidently in your English conversations. Whether it's a casual, hi, or a formal, good afternoon, remember, a warm greeting is the first step to a successful conversation. Thanks for watching and see you in our next lesson. Keep practicing and keep smiling.